stakeholders were sensitized at the Ministry of Business hosted workshop on the regime and consultation of the draft movable property bill at the Marriott Hotel. Crystal Stoll was there and filed this report. The Inter-American Development Bank-funded project aims to allow the use of movable property as collateral when seeking to access finance. Minister of Business Dominic Gaskin said the workshop is intended to sensitize stakeholders on the draft movable property bill. It involves the setting up of a register of property, of movable property, at the commercial registry. A consultant has been um, engaged to um, look at the legislation and he is presenting a draft today and some stakeholders are present um, a lot um, many of them are lawyers and um, to actually look at the draft and make comments and recommendations on um, how to improve it and how to make it more suitable and appropriate for our situation. Minister Gaskin added that the bill aims to reduce the lack of access to finance, especially for persons without immovable properties. This uh, piece of legislation allows persons to borrow using other forms of collateral, movable forms, such as a car, a fridge, uh, accounts receivable, livestock, uh, crops if you're a farmer, and various other um, types of assets. So it really broadens the base of assets that can be used to secure loans. The Secure Transaction Regime project is one that builds on an earlier government initiative from 2016. It will see the establishment of a modern electronic registry for registering movable property, the training of staff, improved levels of security, better risk management, reduced transaction costs and time when conducting businesses. Crystal Stahl for InfoHub.